looking at me with your eyes I get a hint of the perfume that I like Wear it like a disguise I come around with the perfect alibi A midnight pouring my heart out like it's water TikTok hello guys welcome to today's video thank you for stopping by if you are new to this channel if you are new subscriber thank you thank you for and you are welcome to this channel if you are returning subscriber thank you for always coming back to watch my video and uh, sparing your time yeah to watch my video don't take that for granted i say thank you in this channel we do a lot of cooking a lot of homemaking and a little bit of lifestyle if this is the content you love watching or you enjoy watching then you are at the right place turn on the notification bell so whenever i post a new video you will be updated in today's video i want to take you through a productive day as a homemaker and we will start with making some breakfast and for the breakfast you are going to have some pancakes yeah some banana pancakes and that is what i'm preparing i'm going to use two bananas and an egg yeah two eggs and also use some flour some baking powder and some vanilla essence so guys stick around until the end of this video this night ain't getting younger feels like chasing a star up and down in the sky i can't get enough of sweet sweet breakfast was ready and that is how my pancake turned out they were so yummy so sweet i have never tried the 
banana pancake but i have tried the Mm, the cake the banana cake so i decided to try it and uh, it nailed it was so good so yummy we really enjoyed these pancakes so i'm going to go to the next chore after having my breakfast i will go and start scrubbing the sufrias my sufrias need a scrub that is what i'm going to do next i'm going to scrub my sufrias because they are not non-stick they are aluminium and aluminium need to be scrubbed because I don't like scrub daily I just give myself time like a scrub when I see that they need a scrub so that is what I'm going to do hope I'm going to motivate someone there who has like these cooking pots the aluminium cooking pots hope you're going to get some motivation to clean your pots and to clean my cooking pot I'm using some dishwash soap then I'm going to use the soap that is that I soak yeah that is just a bar soap that I soak in with my steel wool i'm using that and it really does a good job when scrubbing the sufurias and then i will be using a steel wool that is all that i'm using to clean my sufurias and it really does good job yeah. like scrub all the sufrias that i have i just scrubbed the sufrias that i use mostly yeah and uh, there are only these four there are five but the other one had like the dinner food so this one are the one that i use mostly but the other one are still like new the one i don't like use them because they are the big sufrias so i don't use them <laughs>
The next thing I'm going to do is to clean my living room. Since I, I removed the carpet and cleaned it, I have not come to clean my living room. So I want to clean the floor, clean, clean the seat, then return the carpet. Yeah, and that will be all for my living room. So guys, let us clean the living room together. If you have been watching my videos you will have noticed that there was a plastic carpet here yeah but the way my daughter has done to that carpet i just removed it because he had really torn that carpet so i just decided let it stay that way until maybe i get some money to buy another a bit harder cap plastic carpet or i talk with the landlord and um put tiles in this house maybe that is maybe next year because he told me that he can't put the tiles for now until next year so it is either i, I be patient or i just buy another pl plastic carpet and i uh, put it there hey desire burning like a fire what you gonna do when it crumbles down watch it get higher down to the wire will you let it burn till we almost drown 
returned with the carpet and that is how I cleaned my living room that is how it looks yeah there is no plastic carpet there for now it is going to stay that way that floor I know it is cold that way but we have to wear socks for now there is no otherwise for now and uh, that is how my living room turned out and this was later I wanted to make some tomorrow's breakfast because there was no like bread in the house so I decided to make some cinnamon rolls yeah the my family told me that they missed this, the cinnamon rolls and because there were there was like everything in the house there was flour sugar so I decided to make the cinnamon rolls and for my cinnamon rolls I use I have I have make this cinnamon rolls again in this channel if you haven't um, like check that video I'm going to leave the link to the in the description box for you to check and see the rest the recipe of the the cinnamon rolls I use things that are very available there is flour there is sugar there is a little bit of salt and yeast and some milk and blue band that is all i use for my cinnamon rolls and i make my dough so after making the dough i just cover it and give it like one hour for it to like double itself so after that i will um, come back and prepare the rolls As we wait for the cinnamon for the dough to like double itself because someone gave us it like an hour I'm going to prepare these greens that we're going to have with with ugali for dinner so I'm going to like check them sort them and then I will go and boil them And my dough was now ready so I'm going to like give it a punch to release the air that was in then I'm going to roll it and apply my cinnamon some sugar yeah I just mixed cinnamon and sugar then I will apply butter then apply those the cinnamon and the sugar on the dough so that is what I'm going to do I'm going to roll it out after rolling it out there is no much to do just apply your blue band or margarine then after that pour the cinnamon and sugar mixture and then roll it it's almost like falling in love for the first time all over again Tied to the feeling, but it's a roller coaster in my head. So I'm holding myself on a precipice, and I've been dreaming off the ground. So I'm looking for something that's definite. I'm praying you don't let me down. It's gotta be all, it's gotta be all or nothing.
to my chest Turn them round for the river and hope it's something that I won't regret So I'm holding myself on a precipice And I've been dreaming off the ground So I'm looking for something that's definite I'm praying you don't let me down It's gotta be This was um, after 25 minutes and my cinnamon roll turned out amazing. They really turned out so good, so yummy. I really loved how they turned out. Yeah, and because I didn't have like the baking paper, my cinnamon roll they were like, they burnt, they like re were refusing to move to come out from the baking tray so i'll invest in buying a baking paper but they st i still made it they come out so well so for two days we are sorted for breakfast <laughs> let us prepare some dinner we are going to have ugali some the veggies the kenyeji veggies and some chicken that is all that you're going to have for our breakfast so i'm going to use this pan to make my veggies because they are not a lot so i decided to use this pan and um, i used it and it really did a good job so that is what we are going to prepare Hope you're still getting some motivation. Hope you're enjoying the video. Hope you learned something new from this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Give this video a thumbs up. Don't skip the ads and turn on the notification bell. Yeah, so that whenever I post a new video, you, you will always get the notification. And I do post new videos on Mondays and on Fridays. Yeah, that is the days that I post at 2 p.m. Yeah, sure, you are sure, will sure to, to find a new video on that day if you check on my channel. It's gotta be all or nothing, all or nothing. Oh, oh, it's gotta be all or nothing. Oh, it's gotta be all or nothing, all or nothing. Watch it get higher, down to the wire Will you let it burn till we almost drown? And I cooked the ugali off camera Ugali, for those who don't know ugali Ugali is a mixture of 
flour, maize flour and water. So after that there is how our meal turned out. It was so good, so yummy. The chicken turned out so amazing. We really enjoyed this meal. The family really liked the meal. And uh, we, are, we have come at the end of the video. Hope you loved the video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Until next time, bye guys. I don't care what happens now, where we go, I'll find out if you want it.